in the problem number 75, um, we need to calculate the freezing point and melting point, or probably what they meant is the boiling point of a solution, of actually a benzene solution containing some naphthalene. And in order to um, calculate both of the um, of the freezing depression point and the melting depression point or boiling depression point, um, we need to make use of the Van Hoff equation. So that's the basic um, thing that we need to keep in mind in order to be able to solve um, this problem. And the Van Hoff equation says that the delta T F, which is the shift of the freezing point, is equal to molality of the solution times the K F factor. And an analog equation exists for the boiling point depression. Again, molality times Kb, which is a different Van Hoff factor. So this is what we need to calculate in order to be able to um, determine the final temperature, which will be T final is equal to T zero plus or minus delta T. Okay, um, so let's see what we're given. Um, we know both of the factors in this equation. So Kf from the book um, for naphthalene, uh, no, sorry, for benzene is equal to 5.12 degrees Celsius divided by the molality unit. And Kb is equal to 2.53 Celsius divided by the molality factor. So this we already know. Uh, we also know the, um, the freezing temperature and the boiling temperature of pure benzene. So Tf pure is equal to 5.5 degrees Celsius and the boiling temperature is equal to 80.1 degrees Celsius. Now we know um, that our solution consists of 100 milliliters of benzene, so volume of benzene 100 milliliters. We also know the density benzene is equal to 0.877 grams per cubic centimeter, which is the same as grams per milliliter. We also know that we have a mass of naphthalene um, dissolved in the solution. So mass of the solute uh, is equal to 10 grams. So now that we see our Van Hoff equation, um, we know that one value that we still need to determine is the molality. And the molality is given mm, by this equation.
it's the amount of solute divided by the mass of solvent, not the solution. Very important. So now we can um, calculate the amount of the solute, which is naphthalene, from the mass that we're given and the mass of solvent from the volume that we're given. And let me switch to another screen. Actually. Okay. So the amount of the solute is equal to mass naphthalene divided by the molar mass naphthalene, which is 10.0 grams divided by 128.17 grams per mole, which is the molar mass of the naphthalene. And when we put that in, we get 0.7. 780, oh, oh sorry, 0 0.0780 moles. And that's our amount of solute. Um, now to the solvent, so mass benzene is equal to volume times density, where we know both, so 100 milliliters times 0.877 um, grams per milliliter. And this way we come to 87.7 grams of benzene or 0.0877 kilograms of the solvent. Okay, now that we have both of our um, values that are required in order to obtain the molality, we can calculate it by dividing the 0 0.0780 moles by the mass of our solvent, which is 0 0.0877 kilograms. And here, we have a molality of 0.889 molality units, which is 0.889 grams per kilogram. Okay, so now if we look back at our Van Hoff equations, we see that we have the molality, we have the both factors. So the only thing left for us to do is to put the values in the equation and calculate the temperature shift. So let's do that. So first, let's calculate the delta Tf, which is equal to molality times Kf. So the molality that we just calculated, 0.889 grams per, actually, molality units, and this multiplied by Kf, which is 5.12 Celsius divided by molality units, is equal to 4.55. Degree Celsius shift. This would mean that our TF final, uh, which is the shifted freezing temperature, is equal to the starting freezing temperature of pure benzene, which is 5.5 degrees Celsius, minus the 4.55 degrees Celsius. So the final temperature is 0.95 um, degrees Celsius or one degree Celsius if we round it up. 
What about the delta boiling point? TB is equal to molality uh, multiplied by KB factor, which is essentially the same calculation, just with a different factor. So the factor in this case is 2.53 degrees Celsius molality value uh, unit, which is 2.53. 2.25 degrees Celsius. So the final TB is equal to the 80.1 degrees Celsius for pure benzene plus the 2.25 degrees Celsius. And this way we arrive at a temperature of 82.3 degree Celsius. So yeah, by using the Van Hoff equation and calculating the molality and uh, utilizing the factors that can be found in the table in the book, we calculated the um, freezing temperature and boiling temperature of uh, naphthalene and benzene mixtures.